Come on, buddy, come on. There she is. You ready, buddy? Okay. What's going on, folks? Thanks for joining me on another episode of Black Gun Chronicles. Today, we are out. We are doing the boat reveal, I guess. I, I don't know what you want to call it anymore. We're, we got the boat on the water for the video today. So, it's going to be a good one. Stay tuned for it. We got the good old mud motor, 22 horse in action. Um, but guys, if you're new here, make sure you hit that sub button. We're going to be getting, putting out content all season long. Um, the main gig of this channel is putting out waterfowl hunts all season long, so you don't want to miss them. And... And if you like listening to duck hunting audio, then check out the Duck Gun Podcast. I host it on my channel every week live, and it also goes out to iTunes, all other um, podcast platforms out there. So definitely check that out with Freelance. Elliot from Freelance Duck Hunting, my co-host there. So let's get on with the video. So like I said, guys, we are out here on the boat today. Got good old Chief in the front, in the spot, and then me over here in the motor. So I'm just figuring it out, trying to run this thing. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go. We're just gonna go ripping across the lake, so uh, should be good. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alrighty, fellas, well, how was that? So, honestly, I got a lot to learn about running a boat with a, a mud motor. I put the Z handle on there. Um, I'm honestly not sure if I like it or not because I kind of like sitting down, but you know, because standing up with it, I did some standing up and some sitting down. Um, I just feel like I'm not getting the full range um, when I'm sitting down, though. So, I'll probably have to stand up, especially when I have the blind on this. Um, but yeah, uh, it definitely feels like. Sorry there. You know, it definitely feels like there is a sweet spot for where you put the uh, prop in the water, um, and you know, you really, you really can feel when it starts kicking uh, and moving you, opposed to when you get it too low or too high. Uh, the other thing on there is I might have the motor pushed up too high because it feels like I got to be just about like this to really. Um, to really get it moving but uh, I kind of wanted it up so I could lift it up lift it up so I could go over like you know a log or something like that but maybe that's really not what this is set up for so um, you know I'm loving it I think it's awesome and I think I got a big learning curve <laughs> before season on, on how to operate it so um, yeah definitely a lot of fun so I guess I guess let's rip it let's let's rip it again so uh, I, I guess I really didn't say what kind of mud motor it was last time. It is a 22 horse mud skipper um, kit and I bought it pre-assembled. Bought it from a guy off of Facebook Marketplace. And now we got it fixed up and running. 
Um, definitely could keep doing some upgrades to it, doing some fixing up to it and make it even better. But um, right now it's gonna get me where I need to go on all my hunts and that's, that's all you can ask for. So yeah, I'm gonna keep ripping it, um, having some fun. So I'm just having a lot of fun. Um, like I said, guys, this is a learning curve. Feel free to just roast me in the comments for how I'm driving this, um, how I'm just doing it wrong. I know I probably am, and it feels it feels kind of awkward, um, except for when I stand up. So, <laughs> uh, like I said, learning curve, but I'm having a ton of fun. I'm gonna have a ton of fun this season. So the next plans for the boat, guys. I got uh, ordering of spray paint. I got lights. I got just a bunch of stuff gonna be fixing up on this from the trailer everything so stay tuned for that that'll be the final um, video for the year and then also you know maybe I'll throw in fixing up the blind at the end of that so we'll be all rigged up we got one month we got one month till uh, I need to have this ready for till so I think I can do it I am ready for it I hope you guys are too um, <laughs> there's chief I think he's he, I think he's had enough of this heat and I have too so um, that's all for today, guys. We're going to go ahead and <laughs> get on out of here. So thanks for tuning in. I'm Jordan, Duck and Chronicles, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Let's go.